beautiful people this is your girl chris blue nola i'm back in the building with another video an opinion piece this is going to be on tom brady and of course his um retirement and we're going to also include giselle bunchen um you know guys they recently got a divorce and you know a lot of people may assume well maybe this is the reason why he's making this announcement and he's making this decision so we're going to just pull a few cards to see like was his divorce eventually the catalyst for him making this decision to you know to retire finally right i know she wanted him to retire and he decided to keep moving forward so did this man lose his family because he refused to retire were there other problems you know that led to it you know nothing really happens in a vacuum these days um but we're gonna kind of look into it so um i saw it yesterday on and if i follow the nfl channel on um uh, page on instagram so i saw it on there first but i'm getting this by way of the shade room again i love the shade room real or nah tom brady says he's retiring for good this time i feel energetically it is for real this time i said it yesterday as soon as i saw that on the nfl page i put it in my story that i believe him this time i believe he's retiring i had done a reading um maybe two years ago or maybe a year ago uh for my husband when um, he asked me about it and I done reading and I said I didn't see him retiring at that time. I do feel like he's serious about it this time, but we're going to pull some cards just to kind of like look into it. Also, I was reading on this earlier and my camera went out. So let me tell you the start of this. But before I do, don't forget um, to like this video. Start by liking this video. Put your feedback in. This is a new thing I'm doing where we're going to get in a full setup. And this is going to be more opinion driven and we're going to pull a few cards along the way. Okay. Um, this will, means I get to get on YouTube a lot more because I feel so pressured sometimes to do full fledged readings. And that's just the thing I'm doing. Nobody can, nobody's making me do anything. So it's something I got to overcome. So we're going to pull a few cards on the situation, but I'm going to, you know, read the articles, give my intuitive opinion and pull a few cards if we need to, to kind of like look at the situation. So um this is why we're doing it this way so let's go ahead and just uh and before before we even do that again like this video make sure you throw your feedback in the comment section tell me what you think about us doing it this way um and also too don't forget to book with me at blue um i am running a really juicy special right now very juicy a lot of people are taking advantage of it and i don't usually give it to the entire channel but i am offering it to the entire channel for the month of february you know, I'm in New Orleans, so for us, we celebrate Mardi Gras, so I'm in a festive mood. We're doing a, a sell for, um, a nice a nice sell for February, okay? So make sure you check me out again at BlueNolotero.com, and tell me your feedback on what you think about this now. Um, we're going to still do our full-fledged readings, but I, if I want to get on YouTube more, I cannot be just doing these 30, 40 minute, just full, full out things unless it's something serious. So, this is where we are. We're going to play what he said. And, um, you know, we're going to play with the set. Let me see if I can get the video up to you. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's see if I can get the video up before we start playing. I know the process uh, was a pretty big deal last time. So when I woke up this morning, I figured I'd just press record and let you guys know first. So I uh, won't be long-winded. You only get one super... Emotional retirement essay, and I used mine up last year. So, uh, really, thank you guys so much to every single one of you for supporting me, my family, my friends, my teammates, my competitors. Mm. Uh, I could go on forever. There's too many. Um, thank you guys for allowing me to live my absolute dream. I wouldn't change a thing. Love you all. Man, this dude said, thank you for allowing me to live my absolute dream. I wouldn't change a thing. I wouldn't change a thing. And he was serious about it. Right? His body language. He was emotional. Just imagine for a second. Just imagine you got to live your absolute dream. He was passionate about it. He's passionate about it. Only two quarterbacks in my life that I just really like, maybe three, <laughs> right? And I'm not, you know, I'm a, I'm a foot, I love football too, but 
you know, of course, you know, Tom Brady's won. But for me, from New Orleans, Drew Brees, of course, we won the Super Bowl one time. Um, and, of course, the city was on fire. We were celebrating. And then, of course, the Manning brothers. I love them. Um, but, you know, this man has done some great things in his career. How many Super Bowls has he led his team to? This man is amazing. He'll go down in history as the greatest quarterback of all time. Period. The GOAT. Think about that for a second. So we thank Tom Brady for his, you know, his, um, you know, is emotional. We thank Tom Brady because you got to think, like, think about the people who are, you know, they, they're passionate about their jobs. They have to finally retire. They have to give it on up. And, you know, it's, and, and Tom Brady has been playing since he was in his 20s. So you got, you got to play from your 20s to your 30s into your 40s and even be called an old man playing, right? <laughs> right? You know, I was telling my dad about it. Oh, you heard that Tom Brady, you know, is retiring. And my dad, my dad was like, yeah, he's an old man. He needs to sit at home. But this man got to live his absolute dream every single day. Was it at the expense of his family? But he said, I don't regret a thing. So we're gonna kind of look into his uh, his messages a little bit, and um, and um, I did go on his Instagram, and I did see where he was posting tons of family photos, and Giselle did respond, right? Uh, but she did it in his comment section. Um, so let's read that really quickly, and then um, I'm gonna talk about this card that I pulled for him because I did pull it, but then my camera was not charged, so I had to stop and charge it and do this again. But that's okay. That's okay because I still feel the same passion about it. So Tom Brady's ex-wife Giselle Bunchen, which is him well, following his announcement, his retirement announcement. Tom Brady's ex-wife Giselle Bunchen reacted to the retirement announcement on Instagram. Right on his comments, right in the comment section. She commented, wishing you only wonderful things in, the, uh, in this new chapter of your life. Word, your life. Not our life, your life, right? Her legal documents obtained at people by at people. The petition for dissolution of marriage was filed and finalized on October 28th. That's baby, that's the fastest divorce I ever did see. That means they must have legally had something in place already, like a separation, right? Where they were already doing the separation paperwork and un, 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 unbeknownst to people, because that's mighty quick. Or maybe in that area they do that. But child, that was the fastest divorce I ever seen. Um, the paper was officially uh, declares the marriage as dissolved and irretrievably broken. So real issues in that marriage, right? Irretrievably broken. So when I first started dealing for him before I lost, <laughs> you know, power, um, the star card came out. This is Tom, right? I do feel he's serious this time, guys. I would be surprised if he reneged on it this time. The star card for Tom, it, this this is uh, uh, energetically represents him having a new beginning, a rebirth, if you will, cleansing, right? When you look at the star card, this person is pouring from different cups and, you know, this cup is behind him, this cup is in front of you. There's a new beginning energy. So I do feel he's serious about it this time, as I said in my, um, on Instagram. Right. I do make sure you follow that Instagram, too, because I always post little prediction stuff in there, too, um, in the story, mainly the story. But this does show he's going to have a new rebirth. Right. A rebranding, a rebirth. You'll be seeing him doing a whole lot of other things. He may take a break, but it's not for long because this is a person who's going to get busy. He may take a break, but he'll be getting busy. All right. So this is what this is what represents Tim when I first started. Any other messages for Tom Brady, his retirement announcement? Give me the energy around. What made him, which, what pushed him to this decision, Spirit? Tom Brady. And it was very emotional. Whoa. I'm going to say this. I do feel like his relationship with his wife and his family and his life. Even though he said I wouldn't change a thing, I do feel like that had something to do with it. This talks about a person who went through a loss. A person who now went through a loss of a relationship. That could be an emotional loss. That could be somebody who uh, who's going through something. He also has the Ace of Pentacles, right? Did I make the right chance? Uh, did I make the right decision? Did I, you know, that could be a person who feels like 
they and that's just now I know he said I don't regret a thing but that could represent a little regret in his energy right losing something value very valuable at the expense of something else that you think is very very valuable right I do feel like in their marriage they lost their way this is what it talks about like when you check out of your marriage and you're not supporting your spouse and you guys are not putting time into it, time into it emotionally, time into it, real time into it, this could really hurt a marriage. This is what it talks about. So not in the marriage, not investing in the marriage, not investing in a relationship, not listening. Also, too, we decided to do one thing and you did something different, right? That could cost you in it. Because what happens is now it's almost like you're doing, you know, in it because we had a decision to make. Even though it's ultimately his decision, this talks about they could have had some type of decision about the direction they were taking. And this is on top of an already what it feels like struggling situation. And you decided to do something different. So I do feel like his decision to do his retirement is a reflection of some sometimes when you lose things it may it makes you reflect on it right it also talks about you know what I'm, it's time for me to make a new start so this is what that represents any other energy around tom brady as it relates to his retirement we're going to just pull a couple more cards for mr tom brady and that's seven of swords remember i, I said i was going to retire then i rethought it but this time I'm manifesting forward, right? And I'm going to be honest. I really feel like a lot of his decision has, is hindering upon his relationship. It, it, it does. It talks about his expectations of what he did was unrealistic. I'm sorry. This has caused him depression. This has caused him to feel... I feel like his life, got out of, his life is out of balance right now, right? I'm sorry, but he will renew. He will regenerate. He will move forward. Give me the energy around Jodell Bunchen. Where is she now? Do they have the potential to reconcile? This says in your new life. Ooh. And she has the moon card, which is in reverse. She has the five of wands. I don't see them reconciling like that, guys. Right? So I don't see them reconciling. This is a person who's saying, you got to take care. You got to focus on you and I'm going to focus on me. They really had real issues in their relationship. So again, quality time, investment, investing into each other. There were conflicts about decisions, etc., etc. Um, Right? So at the end of the day, I don't see where they're reconciling. Like this lady, she's avoiding, she does, she just wants to be at peace, right? Relationship just started going in a different direction. They weren't on the same page. They weren't feeling the love like that, right? When two people go in a different directions, people start to become roommates, become friends. It's period. And I do feel like that, that, that separation had been going on way before they made the announcement. This is a person who was holding on for the fear of change, but decided to walk away, right? I don't see where Tom and Giselle are going to get back together. Not at this time. Not Nothing is set in stone. Things can change, but I don't see that. What will he do? What will he get involved in? Some people get involved in sports casting. Some people get involved in personal businesses. What will he end up doing? Well, this will be our last one. He's got a lot of different things he's thinking about. This is somebody who can still get in there and you never know. You never know if he could go be a coach, you know, change a profession. He got the change a profession card. This talks about taking the next step, change a profession, healthy conflict, promotion. So this could be Tom coaching. This could be Tom, you know, doing some business ventures. This could be Tom. Um, Tom got some Tom got opportunities coming his way. He's got the card of stiff competition and he's a competitor. So I wouldn't be surprised if Tom gets out there and starts coaching. I wouldn't be surprised, all right? Anyway, guys, thank you so much for allowing me because it gets him to stay in the game, but then he can do it from the coach perspective. He's young yet. 
and he knows it. He's strategic. He's that amazing freaking dude. But again, it can be coaching. He can get into his own little businesses, but he got the card of competition, still competition. So you just never know. You might hear about Coach Tom Brady down the road. Never know. Never know. Even if he says not right now. Never know. Still young yet. All right, y'all. Thank you so much. This is Chris. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Don't forget to um, share your thoughts. These videos won't be too long. And have a great day. Peace and blessings. And Tom Brady, thank you so much for all that you have given, you know, as a as a, as a sports um, uh, person, as a, a, a quarterback, a leader of your team, given to all, you know, it's, it's been exciting to watch. Even if you're not rooting for that team to see somebody carry the torch the way that he did. Period. It's exciting. Take care, stay blessed, encouraged, and empowered. Bye.